Hello and welcome back to Minecraft with Yankee for episode 2 of Foolcraft 3. Today we're going to be finding a spot to call home. I think this is actually our best option. So we'll set up a, a house here. And then we're going to be setting up a farm, doing a little bit of mining, and looking at options for power. So let's go ahead and get started here. We got a little bit of cobblestone, so our first area will be made out of cobble, unfortunately. Um, I'm thinking right over here. I like this. So, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And that should give us a 9x9. Nine nine. Oop. Alright, so we got the house frame built. We'll go ahead and see if we can't find some glass here in a little bit, but for now that should do fairly well. We'll just throw some blocks in here quick, frame out the doorway, we'll get our double doors set in here. There we go. And I don't believe that we have very much wood see yeah we don't have any wood so we'll go ahead and grab these saplings how do we not have any wood and we've got all these saplings ah because we cooked it all up for charcoal okay I still feel like we're missing some wood for some reason anyway whatever go ahead and get a tree farm set up here just something really quick so that we got some kind of wood coming in. Yeah, good enough. And then we're going to go ahead and build ourselves a hoe. So we're going to need some more of this. Turn these back into normal blocks. There we go. Okay. Now we have water here, so we're going to utilize this since we don't have anywhere else that we can put it at the moment as we don't have any iron there we go all right replace 
place our torches here. One there, and we'll put one over in this area somewhere. Go ahead and finish laying this out. Hey, wormies! Alright, so that's one, two, three, four. Okay. So it is close enough. So one, two, three, four. There we go. I think that'll give us plenty of room. Won't be the greatest farm ever, but, you know, it'll get us by. So we'll go ahead and put the worms down. And they do a three by three. So, place a couple like that, and come over here, put one here, yeah, that's good enough for now. Alright, so let's get some seeds, and these gardens, break the gardens and they turn into food, Bloop. and then you can convert these back into Pam's Arbor Scraft seeds, just like that. So we'll go ahead and switch all these back over. Oop, that's a normal carrot. We got onions and we've got wheat, of course. We don't need the wheat ones because we've got wheat. And mustard and bell peppers. We'll just do one. There we go. All right, so we'll take our normal seeds and we'll put these here. And then over here, we'll start with the Pam Service Craft stuff. There we go. And get all these planted, and then we'll have a steady influx of food coming in. All right, so we'll put the we'll put the carrots here, and we'll make a new row for carrots. And then we'll make another row for wheat. There we go. Looks good to me. Alright, so that's our farm set up. We will expand on that later on after we uh, actually get some iron and uh, get a bucket going. So, what else, what else? Alright, we need to go mining, which I'm sure nobody wants to sit through. So, I will be back in a second. Alright, so we found some black quartz, but still no iron. We're a little bit further than we were down in the mine. So, uh, we'll go ahead and grab this and keep heading down. And, uh, I'll bring you guys back in when we find some iron. See you soon. Hey, and we found a cave. So, still have not hit iron, but we did find the cave, so that's cool. There's some iron. All right. We'll just have to be careful that we don't attract any unwanted attention. I think he's coming this way. Yep. Woo. All right. So we've got eight pieces of iron from that. That's good enough for now, I guess. Let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> so we're going to run back up here. Oop. There we go. There's some tin. Can I? Yeah. Awesome. Might as well grab that while we're down here. Alright, so we'll go cook up some of this iron, get a bucket, and fix our farm a little bit more. Make it look a little better. And then uh, we'll start looking at uh, power options. Awesome. into my head. So when I was playing the pack before, there is, yeah, there's a pick called a Kappa pick, and uh, the durability on it is a lot higher than a normal pick. It's 31,513 durability, and it's just two iron and a brick with sticks. So we're going to be crafting up one of those. And that will replace our... Um, 
our stone pickaxes that we got here. Um, we are going to need some some clay for that, so I'll go grab some of that in a minute. Let's go ahead and get this iron cooked up. And we're going to need three for the bucket, and then we're going to need two for that pick. Cook faster. Alright, well, while that's doing that, let's see. Hey, we already have a little bit of growth here. So we got three cucumbers. And eventually down the line, we'll actually, you know, cook them up and mix them and all that fun stuff. So, oh, hey, corn too. Nice. All right. Glad we got food coming in now. Okay, let's see how we're doing here. All right, and then we need two for the cap pick. There's our bucket. Thought I heard a creeper. Scared the crap out of me. All right. Let's get some water here. There we go. And we'll put this one, and we'll put it here. And then we'll we'll do corners for. There we go. And we'll make this one all wheat. There we go. All right. And then we've got two of these guys, so we'll throw this one here and this one. Oh, you can't put them kitty corner. Hmm. All right. Well, we'll put that one there, I guess. All right. And then we'll throw these down. Like so. Oh. Oh, I forgot about that. They, uh... They till the area. Forgot. Alright. So... Yeah, we'll do it that way. That's fine. And, uh, the worms give a small growth tick to whatever's growing nearby. So, we're gonna want a little more water probably here-ish. It's not going to be pretty, but like I said, we'll come back and we'll fix it later. Let's grab some more water here. Here we go. We just want the food up and growing, so uh, we'll put one here and one here. Yeah, what the hell, one here too. Alright, we get all this wheat growing so that we can have lots and lots of food. Yeah, it's good enough for now. That's about all we got anyway at the moment. So, we need some clay, so let's bring up our map here. I'm going to assume right in this area would be some clay. So, let's head that direction. And we're looking for clay and sand. And hey, these two while we're at it, why not? We're already out here. And there's there's multiple types of these uh, these little garden things. So, we'll be getting quite a bit as we go through. Just, whoa. Okay, I, I grabbed too much of that. My bad. <laughs> Alright, we still need clay, so let's go down here to the water. Collect these eggs as we go, because those will come in handy later. And it does look like we have a little bit of clay here. Actually, quite a bit. Nice. Alright, so we'll go ahead and vein mine this. There we go. And then we got a bunch now. Awesome. And we might as well grab this guy while we're here. Oop, 
Where'd he go? There we go. And a couple of ink sacks just in case something comes up where we need them. Okay. Go ahead and grab these. And we'll head back to base. Which I probably should have marked on my map. So we'll go ahead and do that as soon as we get back. And we can delete our death point over there. Okay. So we'll go ahead and remove the death point. I don't want it in front of the house. I'm going to put it like back here so it's out of our way. There we go. New and home. There we go. That'll work. Alright, so let's get some of this glass cooking up, or sand so we can get glass. And what did I do with the other stuff? There they are. Throw this charcoal in here. Awesome. And go ahead and dump our inventory in here. Alright. Break these down, see what we get. Alright, I don't think we have any parsnips. Uh, we don't have any artichokes. There we go. And we don't have potatoes. Everything else I think we already have in the garden. So we'll go ahead and plant these, plant these, and we'll put potatoes here. That way we can do the same thing that we're doing with the carrots right now. We'll take all the carrots and we'll just continue this row. Yeah, that works. And go ahead and collect what's already grown here. And they grow pretty quick when you got the, uh, the worms in there. So, very nice, very nice. Alright, let's go ahead and dump all this stuff in here. Let's see how we're doing on glass. There we go. And we'll make glass panes. I think they look a little better than blocks of glass. That's not going to be anywhere near enough glass, but it's alright. And we'll, we'll swap out the... Uh, the crap cobblestone later for better stuff. Hey look, some of our trees grew. Oh, that guy doesn't look friendly. Alright, so let's get some better gear going here. I can't fight that guy with what I've got. I don't think it'll last very long. <laughs> Alright, let's throw these in the house. We're going to have to break down some of those trees and get those that wood so we can make some doors as well. And a couple more and that back window will be finished. Alright. What do we got here? Alright. And we'll grab these trees. Throw back down a couple saplings, and we don't have to worry about it. Yeah. Yeah, might as well grab this one while we're here. So we've got a mod called Malice's Doors, so... There we go. Uh, 
Okay, so we want some kind of double door that doesn't look awful. Um, all we have is oak at the moment. So, let's see. Nope, can't make that one. What's well, in a custom door? Doesn't say. Hmm. Wooden glass door. That looks interesting. Let's try that. So we need three pieces of glass and three pieces of wooden oak planks. There we go. We have our wooden glass doors. Let's see how these look. Okay, that's actually kind of cool. Alright, let's get a pressure plate on the inside. There we go. It does open and close both of them, so that's pretty cool. We will make another pressure plate for the other side. That way we don't miss it. There we go. Awesome. Alright, we need one more wall for the glass, and then we're good to go. And we can move our bed inside as well. Did some of my options change here? No, it's still full brightness. Weird. Alright. Grab some more glass. I think that might be good. We might need a little bit more. Actually, that was perfect. Awesome. Okay, so we'll go ahead and move the bed inside and start moving the rest of this stuff inside. Let's see. What I'm thinking about doing is putting some of this oak wood around it as a kind of frame. Maybe it'll look a little better. See how that looks. Well, it's not great, but it's better. Definitely better than what it was. We'll put the bed here for now. I'll start grabbing this the rest of this stuff. Another chest. There we go. And actually, I think we're going to make a crate. Yeah, one of these. These are very nice. They have quite a bit of storage inside of them. So we will make one of those instead of more chests. So, uh, let's put the crafting table here in the corner. Our furnaces can go over here. There we go. Throw these back in here. Oops, not these. These. There we go. Alright. And if you take logs, you get four chests. And then we need a wood casing. So that's sticks. should be what we need. There we go. Okay. And then we need one more wooden plank. There we go. Alright, now we got our small storage crate. Awesome. And start dumping all our items right into our storage crate. And we are out of food again. We got some pork chops somewhere. Pretty sure they're in this chest. There they are. Okay. 
Let's get some food in us before we uh, start taking damage. All right. So let's go ahead and grab as much as we can. Run it back over here, dump it, and then we'll grab the rest and the chests. There we go. Awesome. All right. Um, I think I'm going to leave the chests here, actually, so that we can dump food items into them. And then we'll make a storage crate in a little bit for the food items instead. All right. So potatoes can get replanted. Oop, along with the carrots. We'll grab our wheat here while we're standing here. There we go. Okay. Is that one done? No, almost. Okay. Let's go ahead and dump our food items. Pull the ones that I just put in here and put them back outside. So these are technically food. Food. Okay. Yeah, that's good enough for now. All right, let's go ahead and throw these in here. Perfect. Alright, how much wood do we have left? Three pieces. Alright, so we'll hold off on that for now. Yeah, we'll put it to a vote. What do you guys think? Leave the logs around it or use them for other items? Let me know in the comments. Alright, so we got some more glass going here. We still got some sand. Go ahead and cook these up for a couple more pieces of charcoal so we can make some more torches. Go ahead and light this place up. Let's see. That should be all the torches we need in here. Let's place them outside so we don't get any mob spawns. later but just for now get some torches out here go up here there we go okay so we've got our house done we've got a farm going and I need to go mining so we're gonna call that an episode here for today and next week when our next episode comes out um, we'll have a lot more stuff. Um, I'm going to make another one of these crates just for our ores and maybe another one for our ingots. So, alright. Y'all have a good week and we'll see you in the next one.